Hello, Teenage America. My name is the Rapple Rouser, and we are back with some more Undertale. <clears throat> when we last left off, we didn't fare too well over here, so... <clears throat> Let's see if I possibly do it a little better. Alright. Shite. Okay. Um, pray. <coughs> Excellent. All right. So we get past this point. Then on to the next area. Uh, oh, don't want to fight. Oh boy. There's a lot happening right now. Alright. Oh boy. Oh god. There's one down. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Oh goodness. <clears throat> oh. Whew. All right, one more time. I wonder if I can go back and possibly buy some food for my character. I do have a glam burger, but now that I have money, no thanks to that spider, I could probably buy more. All right, the lasers aren't turning on and off again. <clears throat> oh, crud. It's a long way back, so you know what? I'm gonna see about hitting the save point again, and see if it'll let me continue. You guys with the way this is starting, I'm not gonna get very far. All right, back to full health. <coughs> and if it restarts, well, then I'll get good. Okay. What a nightmare. Oh boy, this is gonna be hard. Spare you. Oh, crud. All right. Shoot. All right, one last guy to take care of. I don't remember how to take care of this. Okay, so that's not working. Challenge.
pick on. Oh, crud. Thank goodness. Alright. Now <laughs> we're gonna have to go back and save again. Just shows how good, uh... Good I am at this game. <clears throat> Alright. Hopefully that's last in that bridge, and all that's left is Asgore. Or... I, fl I flip that switch and... something happens? Huh. Okay, I've been there. Hmm. I've solved that. I remember seeing that. Sure. Why not? Can't go down. So let's go up. I don't think I've been here. Oh. <sighs> Alright, so basically do what he asks. Okay. Oh. I see. This is back at the beginning of this area. <clears throat> and coincidentally, I can buy things now. Alright, fine. You know what? Thanksy, have a fab full day. What? Why do you keep trying to talk to me? I'll give him trouble if I get chummy with customers. Sorry. So I wanted to be an actor. Take it from me, little buddy. He looks really creepy. I'm getting on in years, so let me give you some advice, little buddy. I'm not going to question what he's smoking. You've still got time. Don't live like me. I'm 19 years old and I've already wasted my entire life. That hurts me. <coughs> Listen, I like you, little buddy. So I'm going to save you a lot of trouble. Never interact with attractive people. Unless you're one of them. They're just going to take advantage of you. Like that time those two chicks asked me to sneak them some glam burgers. And I, native teenager that I was, said yes to them. <coughs> Bad idea. So I went out to the alley to see those two ladies and, uh, you know, see what happened next. <coughs> then my boss, uh, saw me and asked me what I was doing. I was so startled, the hamburgers in my pockets tumbled out into the ground. I wanted to lose face, I scrambled to pick them up. But as I was leaning over, where the little remaining hamburgers caused my pants to fall down. Then the girls laughed at me. Everyone calls me Burger Pants now. Poor guy. <clears throat> when I first came to Hotland, it was my dream to work with Metaton. Well, be careful what you wish for, little buddy. <clears throat> <clears throat> God, have you ever even looked around? This place is a labyrinth of bad choices. And every time we try to change something for the better, he vetoes it and says that's not how they do it on the surface. Oh, right. Humans are always eating hamburgers made of sequins and glue. Why else is MTT bad? Why do people find him so attractive? He's literally just a freaking rectangle. You know, one time... 
probably one of those uh, kits online to uh, make yourself more rectangular. They don't work. Future? What future? Nothing down here ever changes. I'll probably be trapped at this stupid job forever. But wait, there's one thing that keeps me going. If Asgore gets one more soul, we'll finally get to go to the surface. It'll be a brand new world. There's got to be a second chance out there for me. For everyone. So stay strong, little buddy. When I make it big, I'll keep you in mind. <coughs> Anytime, little buddy. See, it's interesting to learn new things about these people. Whoa, room service. Got my CT? Can't say I do. Then... Oh, room service. Alright. I'm betting I missed something there. Anyways. Let's see what these two ladies over here were selling again. mystery key. I could buy it, but I have no idea where it goes to. I'm sure there will be someone out there that would be willing to tell me in the comments if I ever uh, get back to this game again for a different playthrough. <coughs> there we go. Alright, well, let's get back to the core. <clears throat> hmm. This is the troublesome thing. We're about twelve and a half minutes in, and who knows what all we have to see. <clears throat> oh yes, there you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not malfunctioning. Reprogramming. Get real. This was all just a big show. An act. Alfie's been playing me for a fool the whole time. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be a part of it. So she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles. She disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you. Also, she could save you from dangers that don't exist. Also, that you'd think she's a great person, that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alfie is waiting outside the room. And during our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I have no desire to harm humans, far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? Well, what's a good show without a plot twist? <coughs> hey, w what's going on? The, 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 the door just locked itself. Sorry, folks. The old program's been canceled. But we got a final that'll drive you wild. A finale, sorry. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed. Our new show. Attack of the Killer Robot. <coughs> Burn? That's probably what do you What do you do if things continue in this manner? How I was one that hired everyone to kill you. That however was a short sighted plan. You know it would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself. Oh right. This is not only I've seen you fight, you're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul. With your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. If I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can 
save humanity from destruction. Oh boy. Yeah, we're at time right now, so we're going to figure out how this fight works in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching. Hope to get to the next one. Bye-bye, everyone.